Well, hey everyone, welcome back to A Year of Boxes channel. I'm Jessica. I'm super glad that you're here because today we are unboxing one of my absolute favorite boxes. I mean, there is a reason why this box is so well loved, not only on A Year of Boxes directory, but throughout the subscription box community. This one is one to try for sure. This is a luxury book box featuring collectible editions of classic books and thoughtful, beautiful gifts. So this is really for those of you who appreciate classic literature. You're not going to get a bunch of the new or trending books. You're going to get classics only here. It's $74.99 per quarter and $11.95 shipping to the U.S. at this time. We do have a $5 off coupon code, and oh my goodness, can I just tell you that normally this box is sold out. It's always sold out. They're always, always on a wait list because it is so well loved. But right now there are a few boxes. So if you go to the site, I would say run, don't walk, <laughs> and go and use the coupon code and get your box and get your spot in the subscription because um, that will ensure that you get all the future boxes too. So if you don't want to be spoiled by the box that you're going to receive if you subscribe today, this is the box that you would get. So if you don't want to be spoiled, then maybe don't finish this video, come back and see me after. Um, but otherwise, let's dive right into the June box. So the Literary Book Club always has, look at this beautiful packaging, it's just so gorgeous. They always have a card on top with a gorgeous wax seal that kind of gives you a little bit of a sneak peek or like a teaser of what kind of color palette they're going to use for the quarter. And purple, oh, just totally like makes my heart skip a beat. So inside this card, we're going to uh, find out what book we are featuring, they're featuring this quarter. And it is The Enchanted April. So on the back, it talks a little bit about the book. So The Enchanted April is a story of four mismatched women who respond to an advert in the Times offering a beautiful medieval castle to rent on the Italian Riviera. Okay, that sounds so fun. I have not read this one and I'm not familiar with it. So I'm super excited to see what types of travel or Italian Riviera type things we're going to receive inside. Love that so much. And then there was also a postcard in there. I'm guessing this might be the Italian Riviera. <laughs> Not really sure, but it sure looks gorgeous. Oh, have you ever been? Let me know in the comments. I would love to go. My husband's Italian, and I think it would be so cool to go someday. So we'll see. All right. So inside the box, we always have all of these gifts that are kind of wrapped up so beautifully. And we can either choose to prolong our unboxing experience by opening them when we are supposed to based on the page of the book, or we can just kind of open them all up front. I could never, ever wait. Even if this wasn't my job to do this, I could never wait. I would just be too excited to see them all. But let me know if you would wait. If you received the Literary Book Club, would you have the self-control to wait. Oh gosh, I don't know. I'm going to pull them all out so we can kind of take a peek at all the different things and find our book first. Um, so each book that you receive inside the Literary Book Club is a beautiful custom print. They, uh, they print it themselves or they have it printed. Um, so it's gorgeous and it is not something that you can just, you know, buy off the shelf like this. So here it is. This is our beautiful, beautiful book. It's The Enchanted April, Elizabeth von Arnhem, illustrated by Kelly Ann Dalton. Look at how pretty it is. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Okay, is that called the four edge? I think this is called the four edge. I'm gonna have to Google it, but it's not the spine. I think it's the four edge. It's so, so beautiful. Look at this. All of the books, that um, I've ever received from the Literary Book Club are just like, could be home decor pieces. So love that, love the purple theme. And then now we have all of our gifts that go along with the book. Um, there's always something to eat while you read or a treat to enjoy while you read, um, along with gifts that are marked by page number. So we will start with this little packet here, which is kind of like our swag bag. I'm really digging this purple. What do you guys think about the purple and the color palette. Oh, I'm really loving it. Okay. So this is our book plate for the month. And then we have some stickers. Ooh, these are like vinyl decal stickers. I don't remember them being like this last time. 
it's like a replica of the book. The emblem that we're seeing on all of the different kind of stickers throughout. Another kind of quote. And then a little bookmark as well. I'm really loving this design too. I just think that is so pretty. Okay, so there's our swag bag. And then we always have, like I said, something to enjoy while you read. So let's give a look at this first. Inside this bag. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. These are lemon hard filled candy. I love everything lemon. I just give me all the lemon. This is perfect for me. I love it so much. I can't wait to try that. I'm so excited to try those. Okay, delicious. So something to enjoy while we read and then another while we read. This is such a pretty little envelope. And we have, oh, Rejuvenation Blend Herbal. So this is a tea, a loose leaf tea. And it's ginger root, lemon peel, apple pieces, licorice root, and rose petals. Ooh, what a fun blend. I'm excited to try that. Okay, and now we have our gifts that are labeled by page number. We have page 11, page 52, 231, and open when the last page has been read. So let's go in order based on your comments from last time. We're going to start with page 11 and see what we have here. Oh, it's that beautiful pattern. Oh my goodness. I think it's a passport holder. Does that mean that we have to take a trip now? Isn't that the rule? If you if you get a passport holder, you have to go somewhere? I mean, I think so. <laughs> Where should we go? Why it would really be being unselfish to go away and be happy for a little because we would come back so much nicer. I love that. Yeah, I always come back nicer after a vacation. For sure. I love that. Okay, that is awesome and very practical. Okay, next is page 52. What do we have in this pretty velvet bag? We have Mimi and August, a Amalfi. Oh, it's a candle, a little mini candle. How cute. Oh, wow. It smells delicious. Very citrusy. Um, a little bit sweet, but not like too sweet. Maybe, maybe a little lemony. Love that. That's so pretty. Okay. And then lastly, open when the last page has been read. Oh, I just love this. It's so pretty. What do you think is inside? Take a guess and let me know. Okay, let's see. Oh my goodness. Okay, this is so pretty. Can you see? This is a vase, a bookshelf vase, and it's designed to match the Enchanted April cover. Oh, I just love it. So you kind of set it up on your bookshelf um, and you can fill it with flowers or fake flowers and it kind of like looks like it belongs on the bookshelf. Oh my goodness. That is so, so beautiful. Well done, the Literary Book Club. I love everything that I've received. It is always, always a home run and it truly is a magical experience. Oh, I totally forgot. We have a little bit of an art print down here. Let's take a look and our pack-in card to make sure we didn't forget anything. So it always comes with an eight by 10 art print. This was the simple happiness of complete harmony with her surroundings, the happiness that asks for nothing, that just accepts, just breathes, just is. So pretty and it comes in that beautiful pattern that goes with the theme of the box. And these are fun because you can just switch these out every season, maybe have a frame dedicated to these art prints in your living room or in your office, wherever you do your best reading and kind of switch it out with the month, with the theme, with the quarter. So pretty. So there we have it. And then of course we have our product card that just kind of talks about the products that we've received in our box. I love it. Well done. Well done. Well done. Let me know in the comments what you think. And if you want to get a spot in the Literary Book Club, now is the time to do that. Make sure you check the link below for our coupon code, $5 off, and go ahead and get this box. You will not regret it. I cannot believe I forgot this little guy. Look at this gold one just sitting here in front of me. This is page 231. Let's back it up and take a look. Oh, Okay, we got a makeup, a mini makeup eraser. I love these things, by the way. I use them all the time, every single night to wash off my mascara. Okay, I've never actually seen one 
in a print before. How pretty is that? That's gorgeous. It goes along with the floral theme. That is really, really pretty. Um, really, truly, I use this every single day. Not this one, but I will use this one. Um, and it just takes your mascara off effortlessly. I've never had a, prod a product that could take it off so easily. You just get it wet with water. You don't even need to use soap, and it will wipe that mascara right off. I love it. And these can go right in the washing machine, too. Okay, take two. We are finished unboxing the June box of the Literary Book Club. Again, total home run. I am so, so, so pleased. Let me know what you think in the comments and what your favorite product was from this curation. Um, and as always, thank you so much for watching.